Hey there guys, it's RandomAc5 and in today's video I'll be showing you how to convert classic levels to beta. This will be good for if you had a really good city in your classic world and you wanted to convert it to beta. So if you do not know how to save your classic worlds, what you want to do is, so you're on Minecraft Classic on the browser, click save, then save again and it should open up your documents. Now just save it to anywhere and it should be a .mine folder, so Minecraft file, sorry. Once you do that, you should have a file like this. Mine's just called Minecraft Brick Small City. I don't know why I named it that. That's but I named it that when I first played Minecraft. And here is another example, a .lvl level. This is for MC Forge, MC LOL, any uh, classic server file uses those. So this is just my world on my old classic server. So it works with .dats as well. So what you need to do is have MC edit, so download that, link in the description. Now run it, and what you want to do is create new world and name it the world that you want to name it. So I'm going to go classic from, wait no, it'll be, let's just put classic world, then go save. Now chunk type, you just want to click flat, and change that to creative if you want it to be creative mode and go create okay look down then what you want to do is click import and then go to your desktop wherever your saves are sorry now down here where it says levels and schematics change that to this then go to where you saved your saves mine's just in the saves file and I'm going to choose my dot mine file open that and just look directly down anywhere like so now what you want to do is click import now wait for this to import and I'll be right back okay once it's imported you still have it selected now what you want to do is move it around so that the chunks are in order so can you see these dark lines they are your chunks so what we want to do is move it over until the dark lines are right to the edge. So we're like that. Can you see how it's just a bit thicker and darker? And there we go. Now you can click Control D, and that deselects it. Now you want to select here. Has if you have a checkerboard at the bottom around the outside, what you want to do is click right click to change your mode. Now click in this square, go right click again to change your mode again, and then click in this square. Click chunk control and go delete. Yes. Go control D to deselect and do the same for these chunks here. Chunk control, delete. Yes. Control D to deselect and there we have the world I made when I first played Minecraft. Little tiny houses here. Uh, go down a little bunker, a little cave system here. So there. Now what you want to do is go... No, before you do that is you want to move your spawn point. So I'm going to move my spawn point to there. My player to there. Control S to save it and I'll be right back again. Okay, now it's done. You might have some red chunks. That means it's loading. Now you can close out of your MC edit and open up your Minecraft. Do the exact same thing for the .lvl file. So, yeah, exact same steps, I would say. Now, single player, and it'll be Classic World. Open that up. And there we are. So now you can see all the chunks around the edges. That's the Minecraft generation kicking in. You can remove that again in MC Edit, but not deleting the chunks, but getting rid of them. So here we have lava spilling out the sides. So if you don't want that, you can just um, edit it in MC Edit. Some of these trees might generate as well. So like, can you see that tree there? That's a a swamp tree that generated because of the Minecraft terrain and all that's a bit weird. Same with this one. And we cut straight for a ravine. So yeah, that's how you convert your classic worlds to beta. If you have any problems, just send me a personal message or tell me in the comments below. I'll probably help you a bit more if it was a personal message since it isn't like a whole load of 
I wouldn't say it's spam, but it's kind of a whole load of replies in the comments. So just send me a personal message and I should get back to you. So please like, comment, and subscribe, and enjoy your classic world.